Welcome to LISO 143. Here we have a rolling cart setup, a desktop computer, and an HDMI cable, which you can use to plug into your own personal laptop. Currently, the TV is turned on, and you can see that I'm already logged into my account with my AIC credentials. The computer has a power button right there, and you can tell that it's turned on because the power button is illuminated. If you come into the classroom and the TV is not on, there's a remote control tethered to the stand. Simply press the power button, and it will turn the TV on. The source button on the remote, right there, brings up the source options. As you can see, PC is selected. I hit the source button and I can switch to my personal laptop which is HDMI 2. The TV automatically switches. And if I want to go back again just use the source button on the remote control and hit it until PC is selected. There's a keyboard and mouse attached to the computer and we also have a docking camera. To access the docking camera all I did was go to the start menu and selected camera. And as you can see, there is the dock camera displayed. Located here, you can see that the desktop computer, as an audio source, has Samsung Intel display audio. That means the desktop is going to use the TV to output any audio you choose to play, whether it's a video or a music file. With the HDMI cable into your laptop, that should also be the audio source for your laptop as well. Should the remote not be in the room, which hopefully it will be, there's a little push button here, right under there, which brings up the menu for the Samsung TV. However, with the remote, it is much easier to control both the source, volume, and power of the TV. When you're all done with the system for the day, simply turn off the TV with the power button on the remote. Please do not turn off the computer as updates run overnight.